Well, in most cases, uh, most people, in fact, are very suitable for microincision cataract surgery. Um, generally speaking, the vast majority of patients can undergo this technique very successfully. It's only really when, if a cataract becomes very, very hard or is very, very mature, that we may need to consider other approaches. But generally speaking, the vast majority, I would say 99% of people are candidates for microincision cataract surgery. So microincision cataract surgery is performed by making very tiny cuts or very tiny incisions onto the actual edge of the cornea, which is the clear part of the eye that we see through. If you can imagine, the cuts are actually very, very small, measuring about 1.8 to 2 millimeters in size. So we do that under very high magnification. And by doing that, that, as I say, allows us to um, improve the vision very quickly with a very short recovery period, and also very little in the way of discomfort for patients after the operation. Generally speaking, cataract surgery is not painful. In fact, um, most patients actually report it being actually quite a comfortable procedure. We do, of course, have to use some anesthetic and that can take a variety of forms, uh, such as eye drops uh, or indeed a small injection of anesthetic around the eye, which can occasionally sting for a very short period, but luckily uh, numbs or anesthetizes the eye very well, permitting uh, painless surgery. Um, well, from a surgical point of view, uh, it involves us using uh, very easy to use instruments, um, which means that, of course, we can get access to the cataract and remove it very efficiently. Uh, and from a patient perspective, uh, smaller incisions or smaller cuts into the eye mean a faster recovery period, and as well as that, less pain or discomfort postoperatively. As well as that, it also means that patients can see um, very quickly and they can see a lot better immediately after the procedure. Well, whilst cataract surgery is very effective and has a very high safety, there are some small uh, complications that can occur when performing uh, microincision cataract surgery. There is a very small risk of infection when we perform an operation, and that risk has been quantified as being approximately one case in every 2,000. So the risk is quite low, and we take every precaution by giving patients antibiotics during the operation and also giving them antibiotics afterwards. And of course, we do, an op do the operations in a very clean, sterile operating theatre. Um, in terms of other, in terms of other uh, complications, um, there is a small risk of uh, what can be termed posterior capsule rupture. And what that means, if you imagine the natural cataract or natural lens in the eye sits in a clear bag, I liken it to cling film. But essentially what can happen in attempting to remove the cataract from the eye, that clear bag can split. That medically is known as posterior capsule rupture. Now, the risk of that is very low, about two cases in 100, and we take every precaution during the procedure to make sure that that doesn't happen. Indeed, my own audit of the last 200 cases showed no, no uh, cases of posterior capsule rupture. So generally speaking, it's quite a rare complication. After the procedure, the eye can often feel a little bit gritty and a little bit light sensitive. Uh, it can often feel as though they have a foreign body or something inside the eye. Now, that experience actually only lasts 24 to 48 hours. And generally, the vision can start to improve rapidly after the operation and get better and better over the coming days.